First at noon, the very latest on that massive mill fire in Pawtucket. Right now, fire crews still on the scene of what's left of the old Union Wadding Mill. And we've been working the story since the fire started on Wednesday night. Huge flames gutted the Goff Avenue building, and firefighters tell us they could be on scene all the way into the weekend. Eyewitness News reporter Danielle North is live at the Emergency Operations Center in Pawtucket, and she's got the very latest from the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. Danielle? Well, a closed-door meeting here at the EOC in Pawtucket just wrapped up a short time ago, and we witnessed uh, members of the ATF, local and EMA, a uh, local EMA, as well as uh, local fire investigators. Eyewitness News uh, was there exclusively, and we spoke with some of the lead investigators. Here is what we know at this noontime today: there are just simply too many hot spots and smoldering areas at the fire scene on Goff Avenue to send anyone inside today. But Eyewitness News has learned that the ATF's national response team is arriving today. They already have a mobile unit on the scene with all of the equipment they're going to need to begin their interior investigation to determine exactly how this massive fire started. There's chemists, there's electrical engineers, uh, there's, there's a lot of people that are involved in fire investigation who've done these major mill complexes throughout the country and that's where we are. Any idea how long it may take to determine an official cause? We'll be here for the weekend I'm sure. Now, we're told that the national response team from the ATF will be arriving today, but again, no one will be going inside until tomorrow. We're told that what's going to happen is there's going to be some sort of a briefing tomorrow morning. Then the investigative team will be heading inside to gather evidence. We're told after that, any evidence or samples collected inside will either be sent to the Rhode Island Crime Lab or a national crime lab for analysis. We're live with the very latest from Pawtucket this noontime. I'm Danielle North, Eyewitness News. Now you can find much more on the Mill Fire online at our website, WPRI.com, including extended video, a photo gallery of pictures submitted by Eyewitness News viewers, and stories on past troubles at the Mill. And if you have any pictures or video to share, you can email them to report it at WPRI.com.